I've had a lot of emails this past week um, to where we're getting an audio book put out uh, for uh, Ditches to Riches. Nice. Um, my story, just as an entrepreneur, was also picked up uh, by another podcast outlet, so they're interviewing me next week. Um, so I'm getting more traction now. I've noticed my book sales have increased. Uh, so it's, I mean, every week that goes by, every month that goes by, someone hears about it through social media or just me doing the public speaking part. Um, when working with the inmates, we've got a, I've got a great opportunity working with um, a young lady up in Tallahassee. Uh, she works for Medicaid to where we're going to be able to allow to offer inmates when they're getting out of prison and they're on already on a medication or need some type of medical help to be able to, for the first 90 days to six months, continue that medical until they get on their feet. Nice. Uh, so it's just not stopping because if someone has a mental health issue that's getting out of prison and they don't have a follow-up with a doctor because they don't have health insurance, then mm-hmm. what happens? They don't have their medication. Uh, they they go back to what they knew um, and they wind up back in prison.